St. Henry, round number two. Brad Luthman, of course, was on the defensive coordinating staff of Marion Local before he got the job with the Redskins. Very close with Tim Goodwin and the staff. Should be a good Week 12 matchup that we hope to broadcast next week, as well as Delphus Jefferson taking on Mechanicsburg. I have a Fans of the Week update for you. I counted wrong. We have nine schools in our Lee Kinsel Fans of the Week contest for this upcoming week. You can go log on now and start voting at WOSN. TV. We've got Shawnee, Elida, Kenton, Allen East, Coldwater, Bluffton, Macomb, Arlington, Corey Rossin. So you have a week to vote for our final fall fans of the week. All right, football now. Two teams, or three teams in Division Four in our area. One is Benjamin Logan making the trip to Oak Harbor. One is Ottawa Glandorf, a home team. And one is Indian Lake running the table 10 0 and getting state recognition, trying to get a playoff win at home tonight at Laker Stadium, and that's where we head against River Valley. So would the River win or would the Lake win? That is the big question. <laughs> River Valley starts with the ball. Josh Elwood takes the snap, looks to throw, but he is sacked by Parker Groathaus, five-yard loss. Vikings would punt. Alex Jacobs takes the snap for the Lakers, finds Colin Coburn, first down for the Lakers. Jacobs this time looking to Groathaus. Look at this big man. Rumbling down the field, refuses to get taken down. 20-yard pickup for Indian Lake. Jacobs calling his own number here as he picks his way through the defense into the end zone. 6-0 Indian Lake, 547 left in the first missed extra point. Second quarter, Lakers being forced to punt. Nate Kappenbarger boots it away. A.J. Eisler returns but stripped away and recovered by Preston Wright. Lakers get the ball. Jacobs. With legs again, one of our FCA leaders at Indian Lake. Boy, can he play football and baseball and basketball. First down, and then some for number 16. To the air, Jacobs to Coburn. Nice nine-yard connection here. They're knocking on the door once again. Next play, however, Andrew Holbert gets it in for the touchdown. 13-0, Indian Lake in front. Vikings looking to respond. Elwood sacked by Connor Dixon, six-yard Oh, that's the touchdown, I'm sorry. Getting ahead of myself. Here comes Connor Dixon. Big sack for 55. Then Elwood hands off to Spears, gets all the way to the one. Can't get in, next play, Spears. Hits it one more time, 13-7 is the score at the half, but Indian Lake pours it on the second, 34-7. Great job by Dave Coburn and company. Jacobs numbers, 13-29. 169 yards through the air, 166 yards on the ground, combined three touchdowns. Colin Coburn, five catches, 84 yards, and that score.